President Trump continues to publicly criticize special counsel Robert Mueller, though he's been down, downplaying speculation that he's moving to fire him. Mueller is investigating potential ties between Russia and Trump's 2016 campaign and possible obstruction of justice. Cities around the country are gearing up for potential demonstrations if Trump were to fire Mueller. Pittsburgh is among them. An internal police memo reveals how first responders are preparing for that possibility. Kim Gable joins us live with more. Kim. And Mayor Bill Peduto tweeting about an hour ago, quote, this is an internal email from a commander to plainclothes detectives. It doesn't claim to know what the president will do. It doesn't say people can't lawfully assemble. However, what it does say is that those officers need to be prepared. Connecting communities to their police officers. It's been a steadfast goal of the Peduto administration and one of the topics at this citywide public safety meeting in Lawrenceville. First responders constantly reacting to situations and preparing for them. We asked the mayor about the internal email instructing detectives to begin wearing their full uniform and carry riot gear. This is one where the, the commander was making sure that detectives, if needed for any other duty, would have the materials and the resources that they would need to carry out the job. Over 2,300 people have signed up to protest if President Trump fires Robert Mueller. The event website is called Nobody is Above the Law, part of a nationwide series of events. On a routine basis, we receive intelligence about potential problems that may occur within the city, whether it be weather related, whether it be man made, whether it be demonstrations, and we act accordingly and appropriately to have a plan in place. Commander Victor Joseph sent out the email that states, we have received information of a potential large scale protest in the central business district. The protest would be semi spontaneous and more likely happen on short notice. Is there any credibility to the intelligence? We have not adequately looked at that yet. But at the same time, with the time sensitivity that we were made aware of, we took appropriate action. Now, that event website lists the following possible locations for those demonstrations. First of all, the City County Building in Pittsburgh, the Beaver County Courthouse, IRMC Park, that's in Indiana, and the Federal Building in Wheeling, West Virginia. Again, the recipients on that email told they may be needed to assist in the event that there is a large-scale protest. Ken?